tonight. Maybe we'll like, I'm checking it out as we go. I think we Yeah, I'm loving this water tunnel. But, as well as the incredible landscapes that we have, sandwiched between so many other countries like Switzerland and Austria, in the middle of it all, uh, madness in terms of the best drone racing championship in the world. So the best pilots in the world, we're taking them around Europe and some not yet disclosed locations elsewhere in November uh, to do drone racing at 140 kilometers an hour. Um, amazing locations. The Champs Elysees a month ago. Now we are into the regular thick of things with a lot of races coming every few weeks. For race two, it's Vaduz in Liechtenstein. We will be here for the next three years, thanks to uh, the government for agreeing to have us race drones right here. So that big triangular thing with a big uh, crane platform in front of it, that is the Parliament of Liechtenstein. This is the National Museum of Liechtenstein, a protected registered building that we really must not break in any way. Up there is one of the gates that the pilots are actually going to have to do a split S turn through. There's a cable cam at the top to help bring you that. And over here, this building with the uh, zigzaggy roof, that is the government of Liechtenstein. And all of this is part of our course, part of our track. So there's going to be an audience here. Thankfully now the rain has stopped. It's been absolutely torrential for the last couple of days. Uh, we can do it in the rain. The pilots know how to do it in the rain. Uh, it's difficult, obviously. It throws up a lot of technical problems too for an outside broadcast like this, because this is live tonight, as I said, on YouTube. Uh, YouTube.com slash Drone Champions League is where you'll be able to watch it. And this is what we're going to be racing in. So behind all these benches and uh, umbrellas for our audience, is an incredible and really difficult racetrack. This is the stage where our racers will be sitting to compete in two teams of four. If you've not seen Drone Champions League before, it's a very special format. Um, you'll have to watch it to find out. Now we're going to go quickly because we've got access all areas. We're going to pop into the course. There it is. These are the starting blocks. Drones are going to fly down that way through the FL1 gate that we saw, do a split S turn if they want to, or loop round. Some will go sideways, some will come over the top of it. They then fly round here, round this tree, anti-clockwise, between the tree, over the screen, under that black banner, and round the Parliament building. Uh, then they go right in front of that white and yellow building which is the National Museum and up to that gate we saw the Liechtenstein gate which is up on that hill they've got to do a split S turn they'll fly um, over it loop and fly down through the gate towards the ground here loop back around the Parliament building back under there through the Conrad gate that blue one then they will go round the back of the government building